his life. I would imagine they're probably dancing in Dallas, Texas right about now. Uh, Troy Dorsey is tremendous favorite in his home state. Uh, all across Texas, people are, are following Dorsey's career, and I'm sure they're happy now. Uh, his record raises now to 33-2 and two with 18 knockouts. And this victory over Rochette is a milestone in his career. At, at, at this stage, at 34 years old, to beat someone of Rochette, Rochette's stature uh, this decisively, it shows that Dorsey has many more years uh, in kickboxing. And as he said, he also wants to go for a boxing title. I'm looking forward to seeing him again. And now we move on to the fourth and final of our World Championship Kickboxing Bouts. For the light cruiserweight world championship, Marek Piotrowski against Javier Mendez. Here's Jerry Hoffman. Ladies and gentlemen, time now for the ISKA World Light Cruiserweight Championship of the World. Scheduled for 12 rounds with Mr. Peoples, the referee. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing the solid black pants from Warsaw, Poland, weighing in at 185. Quarter. This champion owns the ISKA International Intercontinental title and sports an impressive record of 40 victories, just two defeats, 30 of his wins coming via a knockout, including a victory over Rick Rufus. Let us welcome Medic, the Punisher, Pietro! And his opponent fighting out of the red corner wearing the red and blue colors. He is the hometown hero from San Jose, weighing in at 184 pounds. He is the current ISKA World Light Cruiserweight Champion. 22 and 1 is record of 14 KOs. The local hero, Javier Thunder Mendez. Well, you heard the reaction for the hometown favorite, Javier Thunder Mendez. Here's how the two men measure up. Mendez, by far the older man. I have got to win this fight. Well, as you can see, Merrick is a very aggressive fighter. He comes right out. Uh, he doesn't spend time to feel out his opponents. Petrowski comes in with seven world titles, looking for his eighth, and he's not at all impressed with all of the Hollywood glitter here tonight. He says, I'm not a movie star. I am a fighter. Trotsky's moving up in weight for this bout. He, he holds the ISKA Oriental Rules World title with low kicks at 179 pounds. This bout in the 106 pound division. So it's the heaviest that he's ever fought. He says he's ready though, a lot of upper body work. And we can see that uh, he really does not look smaller in the rings than he does, a little less powerful in the upper body. But overall, not a whole lot of difference. Petrowski was a former Polish national champion as a bare knuckles fighter. He's a man who knows a thing or two about punishment. Look at the kick and punch total. Lots of action in this first round for these big men. Well, I can see right now, if Mendez doesn't gain some respect early on, he's going to spend the whole fight running. And you can't do that with Merrick Petrowski because he will just continually put the pressure on us. You've got to be able to gain some respect, use some power to keep him off of him. Petrowski will do this. He will go forward the entire fight. Right. Even in the ill-fated bout with Rob Kamen in Paris, we saw Petrowski never stop coming forward. You know, the only danger in that is when he fought Rick Rufus, he tried to come forward. And I guess Rick caught him with something and uh, took him out, knocked him right out. So, you know, Piotrowski doesn't want to walk into anything, but it has been a successful fighting style for him. End of the round will go to the blue corner and Piotrowski. If Mendez is going to be moving around the ring like this, utilizing the ring, he needs to be throwing the jab out there to score points. He can't just run and lay on the ropes. 
Mendez is known as the more powerful fighter of the two. Knockout power in both hands and both feet. But as yet, he has no respect from Petrovsky. Well, it's hard to get power when you're backing up. He needs to get his feet planted, get in a good, solid stance, and throw some big punches and kicks. Well, this is way, the way he trains, the way he's one of predominantly, uh, predominant most of his fights, is to put the pressure on, back his opponents against the ropes, and work them. See the welts on Mendez's back early in the fight. A lot of that comes from him being against those ropes, which is where he's been far too often. And a slip at the end of the round for Mendez, but he just was taken advantage of there. Right now, let's go back to Cynthia Rothrock. Roger, so you're used to dishing out a lot of pounding to those big linebackers. What do you think of the pounding that these guys are taking tonight? I tell you, these guys are in great shape to take the pounding what they're taking tonight. I, I take my hat off to them. I'm, do, I'm taking Taekwondo right now. Uh, my kids have been doing it for the last four or five years. Now since I'm at the end of my career, I can focus on uh, on the sport that I always like wanted to do, and, and I'm doing it now. Here's my private uh, instructor here, Eddie Croft. He's a professional fighter too, so uh, he's definitely been giving me a lot of tips on the round kicks and back kicks and things like that. So that's great. So do we see in the future Roger up in the ring kickboxing? <laughs> he's trying to get me to fight. <laughs> you know, because I used to box before, so uh, I used to get my kicks together and get my foot, you know, my, my flexibility a little better, you know, because I'm a little tight still. From well, football. good luck, and back to you, Bob. <laughs> yes, thanks. All right, thank you, Cynthia, and thank you, Roger Craig. Football grade, of course, with the San Francisco 49ers, now playing for Kansas City. Uh, maybe the situation in reverse here. Being in Mendez's hometown, Petrovsky uh, perhaps feels like he has to be the address. Let's go, fight out, gentlemen, fight out! Fight out, up the arms! Let's go, fight out! Didn't seem to do much damage though. Let's go! Yeah, yeah. Punch out, guys! Come on, come on! Come on, come on! Come on, come on! Come on, come on! Like Michelle Rochev in the previous bout, Mendez has taken some punishment. He has to find her. Has not been going tonight. Watch out, not at home. I don't know what his game plan was, but um, definitely um, Marek's style is to move forward, put you on the road to score points, and he's been able to do that tonight. These guys have put on a heck of a performance tonight. Neither one has anything to be ashamed of, that's for sure. And so it is over. Now let's go up to the ring for the decision. Here's ring announcer Jerry Hoffman. We have a unanimous decision by scores of 121-17, 121-14 and a half, and 119 and a half to 115. The winner and new IFKA World Light Cruiserweight Champion, Merrick. It's been a great evening. We hope you all have enjoyed it. Congratulations to Marek Petrowski and all of our new or reigning champions. For Mike Sawyer and Don the Dragon Wilson, I'm Bob Varsha. So long from San Jose, California.